So yeah, great to be here with Erdington Local, as we say, on Short Teeth Playing Fields. And this is the second time I've been back here. And I've also had conversations in the interim with Stephen Hughes, who leads the campaign. So this isn't new to me. And it's very, very clear that uh, communities in the city, often quite dense communities, need uh, green spaces, like their green lungs. It's an amenity for everyone to enjoy. And the first time I heard about the plan to build homes on here, I just thought that can't be right. We must be able to be building homes elsewhere. There's lots of brownfield land around. We see derelict sites. We've got to bring them back to protect and indeed enhance this, perhaps doing more planting, more amenities here. So I was very determined about this and it's brilliant just to see the momentum that the campaign has got. Uh, if you uh, win the election in two weeks time, will you use all your um, different levers of power and every different kind of um, uh, influence you have to uh, ensure that this remains green fields? Uh, so the answer is yes. Let's be really clear. This is a decision for Birmingham City Council, but I can do something else. What I can do is make sure that we do prepare the brownfield sites we've got for coming forward for development. And there are, of course, funds from the combined authority to help in the development of those. So I can actually make the alternatives happen because no one's denying we need more homes across the city as a whole, but it's a question of where that will be. Thank you very much. Thank you.